So hi everyone, we are Karen and Neil. We are the Private Label University. You can find us over here on YouTube. We have tons of free content. Or you can find us over on our website at www.privatelabeluniversity.com where you will find a ton of free content there as well. We have our five-day free boot camp to private labeling, so make sure you check that out. But today we want to talk to you about a question that we get all the time, and that is, what product should I be looking at to sell? What product will actually make me money and bring in the kind of business and kind of sales that I'm looking for? So we decided to do some research and look for the top trending products so, Neil, what did we find? So we went to uh, a lot of different sites. We went to, of course, Amazon and eBay and Rakuten. And then we also looked at Alibaba uh, and AliExpress to see what was uh, the best-selling products. We also checked out a lot of blogs mm -hmm. and, did, and did a lot of research on some of the tweets that were being tweeted, looking at Pinterest, looking at some of the other social media sites to see what people were talking about because that those are areas where you will find clues to products that people are wanting to buy. And some of these products you would never think are hot products that are trending. If you're, you know, in a category um, or you're working with retailers or stores that are, you're only supplying with one type of product, you would never think of some of these other products. So we actually were quite surprised when we saw some of these products and they happen to be really hot trending products. So we're going to jump right into it and I'm just going to look over and I have a few screens here, but some of the hot new products that were on Amazon happened of course to be with the Olympics going on, Olympic items. Anything with Olympic symbols, um, of course with um, uh, Rio on them and Rio and the Olympics, very hot from t-shirts to even you know the old-fashioned scarves with all the printing on them. Uh, very hot products right now and of course that's trending because the Olympics are on. Mm -hmm. So and if you're in a special category and of course as soon as a team wins a gold that type of whether it be uh, weightlifting or karate becomes very very popular. So jump on those if you can. Um, some of those involve you know a little bit more manufacturing if it's t-shirts or socks or things like that but some of the things that you wouldn't think uh, that would be so popular are with Olympic items. So Olympic items, very mm -hmm. hot product. Another hot product, bow ties. And I'm sure you've already heard this, bow ties. Um, I personally don't wear bow ties, <laughs> but they, they, you do. And we do, a, do. We go to a lot of events and we're seeing a lot of people wearing bow ties. Mm -hmm. But again, a lot of what we teach is think beyond what you see because that's where the gems are. And again, another hot product that fell within the, that bow tie category are those little square pocket squares. pocket squares, exactly. So do you want to explain what that is? So I've always thought it as kind of a handkerchief or a uh, pocket scarf. Um, some people, you know, years ago would wear the ascot, where instead of wearing a tie, they'd wear the ascot, kind of a scarf, which is also very popular in Europe. Uh, and they say also making a comeback are the ascots. And you can take some of the smaller ascots, you can take and put in your pocket. And as Karen said, the pocket squares matching the bow tie, very, very hot trend in the fashion industry. And of mm -hmm. course, the fashion industry is huge internationally. Mm -hmm. So something to jump on. Absolutely, and I love that idea. It's cute. Wood products. So wood in the fashion industry. And so we're, we're, we could see that there was a lot trending with fashion. So wood glasses and glass frames, wood sunglasses, wood watches. Mm -hmm. And um, I kind of think myself as an innovator because <laughs> I actually designed some wood glasses, and people know me for my glasses, about 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. uh, and I had a number of different pairs of wood frames made and had my prescription, people would always stop me and go, wow, are those made out of wood? Where'd you get those? Well, I actually had them made. So wood products, wood glasses, wood sunglasses, and wood watches, very trendy right now. So again, do your research, kind of go a little, little deeper into what is hot right now and find the things that work around it because I can guarantee you'll be onto something. Right. So the next thing I'm going to say that was very popular in blogs and trends were paleo products, paleo edible products. So uh, nutrition bars, um, granola bars, um, kind of like the snacks, quick, uh, good quality snacks in that paleo. Not supplements, but actually food products of that type. 
Uh, and, and these days, again, with Olympics and sports and nutrition being very popular, the paleo type of products, mm -hmm. good ones, very popular. Same thing with gluten-free. So people really want to hear and see gluten-free, healthy, um, and seeing the benefits with that. Yes. So, again, do research around those areas. Mm -hmm. There's then, something there. Then looking at uh, eBay and Amazon Rakuten tea products. Mm -hmm. Now, as popular as coffees are and coffee grinders and coffee makers, teas have always trying to be the runner-up. But now you have Tivana and T Plus and T More, a lot of the retail brick and mortar places that have increased the popularity of tea products. So things like matcha tea and all types of derivatives of tea and tea processors, simple items. For a while, they're the little tea diffusers and uh, holders for uh, the travel cups were very popular. Mm -hmm. Now even more of the teas being very, very popular. And for, for good reason. There's a lot of health benefits. Again, the same thing, the health benefits from the different types of teas and specializing. Um, I mean, years ago, years, years ago, I mean, tea was tea. You bought tea. Now there's so many special tea, teas and people are really feeling that and wanting that. So there is a big trend there. Same mm -hmm. thing with coffees, the same thing. And look at, you know, even places as basic as Starbucks. They offer a lot of different teas now because mm -hmm. of the demand for the teas. So the lot, we're going to jump to Alibaba. And on Alibaba, it's uh, I get updates from Alibaba. Uh, I've worked with uh, some of the people who work with Alibaba. So they keep me updated all the time on new trends, not just for America, but of course internationally because they're mm -hmm. an international company. And it was very surprising. Brazilian hair extensions, extremely popular for export. So they look at based on the amount of products exported from Asia and Brazilian hair extensions. Very, no, very I'm not wearing any. <laughs> Neither am I. <laughs> Maybe I need some. <laughs> but extremely popular product on Alibaba. Uh, mm -hmm. Another huge popular product, of course, was mini power banks. Mm -hmm. And we've seen power banks very popular now for at least the past year. But micro power banks... Uh, power banks with multiple adapters on them, very, very hot and still uh, a demand uh, from Asia. Uh, the other thing that was extremely popular was coconut based mm -hmm. products. Yes. Anything coconut related and not just coconut edible products, but also coconut uh, like the shells used in bags or the filament. Uh, anything coconut related was very, very popular. Again, health benefits um, surrounding the products seems to be very, very popular. So again, there you have it. So some really cool trending products that are doing really, really well on all platforms, on Shopify, on eBay, on Amazon, doing really well. So do some research that gives you kind of a little bit of a start. Look around those products um, and do your own investigation. But those are some of the big trending hot products that people are making a lot of money selling. And on, as Karen said before, which was great, Think outside of the box. Think outside mm -hmm. of the box. Things that you wouldn't think are trending, and they are, really look at them and look at those forums and those blogs because it could be something that you could jump onto and, as Karen said, make a lot of money doing it. We are Karen and Neil. We are the Private Label University, so subscribe to our YouTube channel right here. There's tons of information. And come follow us over on Facebook. We have a private Facebook group for entrepreneurs just like yourself who are looking for different ideas or looking to get started or who have already started and have tons of questions with regards to shipping or customs, anything really, we're here to help you with. So make sure you go over to our Facebook page, Private Label University, and join and ask away. Ask away. Also, don't forget, we have that five-day boot camp that is free. It teaches you the steps on how to get started in private labeling and then how to launch your product on Amazon. So we will talk to you soon. Enjoy. Bye for now.